get a Russian girlfriend. <coughs> guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's your guy Loretta Naomi here and so this is a vlog about Uganda students experience about studying in Russia I hope you guys enjoy it <laughs> my youtube channel it's your girl loretta naomi today we are having a ugandan so joshua introduce yourself hi how are you i'm joshua tumwine ugandan studying here in russia actually i've just finished i should not say i've been studying mm -hmm. here i've just finished my course oh how was it uh, the whole study thing how was it for you in russia well i must say it has been really nice uh, because uh, I've studied in like two cities actually, bachelors, I've done it here in Russia in, in a city called Belgrade. Mm -hmm. Then I've done my masters in a, one of the nice cities uh, called St. Petersburg, that's the cultural capital of Russia. Wow. So it has really been nice, I've, wow. I've enjoyed it. Okay, the, yeah. so can you tell us how like the relationships with Russians, how, how was your relationship, how do you relate with Russians? Wow, I must say Russians are really nice. Like. They really like mind their own business, mm -hmm. but uh, when like you get close to them, you find like they are genuine people. Like they are, <laughs> they are really genuine. Like mm -hmm. they are nice people. Yeah. Like uh, unlike how they usually portray them in the media that uh, they are tough and stuff like that, mm -hmm. racist. But to be honest, I've not like experienced like for me racism here. Uh, so did you find? Did you get a girlfriend or padruga? Oh. Yeah, <laughs> Russian girl, yeah. I sh I would I was almost getting actually. <laughs> I was almost and getting. And what happened? All the Russians also asked me why didn't I get a Russian girl? They say mm -hmm. the Russian girls are beautiful. Yeah, that one I must say. Mm -hmm. But unfortunately, I have not got because we have to go for our Ugandans. <laughs> yeah, our Ugandans are better. Oh, okay, okay. So yeah. today you are at uh, Bnukova Airport, uh, going back home. Which airline are you using? Yeah. I'm actually using Turkish airline. Yeah, I'll be flying to Istanbul, from Istanbul to Nairobi, then Nairobi to Uganda. Okay, okay. We wish you a safe journey. Yeah, sure. And yeah, we hope you will come back to Russia maybe for Yeah, maybe yet. PhD. PhD. Yeah, PhD or oh, okay. coming for wow. just summer vacations here mm -hmm. because I like the country really. Yeah, you it's should come for your honeymoon. Like. Yeah, sure, maybe. Yeah. yeah, actually that's a must. I have to, my honeymoon has to be in Russia. <laughs> That is Moscow, Sochi, mm -hmm. and St. Petersburg, wow. those three cities. Wow, cool. So your ending remarks to the new students that will be coming to Russia from any other country, mostly from Africa, what would you advise them? Sure, you have to, when you come to Russia, you have to enjoy it from the start. Like, uh, I would encourage you to actually to, to practice the Russian language and then you socialize, like mm -hmm. you enjoy. Like, there are many opportunities in Russia, so socialize and enjoy your life in Russia. There are many opportunities actually. So, like if I'm to go back to my, like if they tell me to, to redo my whole thing, mm -hmm. I would perfect my Russian and enjoy more. Wow, so yeah. learning Russian is, a, is really a must. It should be a, yeah, it's yeah. a plus, yeah? Yeah, it's a big plus. Oh, it's okay. really an advantage. All right, thank you so much, Joshua, for this we'll interview. See you. Okay. Great time. Okay, okay Nasa. So, how do you feel leaving Russia for good? <laughs> <laughs> He didn't say like that. 
it? It's like an interview. Okay. Yeah, just tell us how do you feel about this whole situation? Are you happy or are you sad? Yeah. Uh, I feel good that I'm going home. But uh, at the same time, I feel sad that I'm leaving Russia because Russia has been my second home like since five years back. Sure. It has treated me like I'm a son of Russian land. So leaving it at this point is going to make me miss it. But at the same time, I'm like, let me go home. I start a new life. Probably later in life, I'll come back for PhD or for bullying around with my friends. Yeah, normally when I say Russian words, my friend here yeah, laugh. That's why you see her laughing. Okay, you'll be bullying. I'll be bullying. <laughs> I'm going to miss my family in Russia, that is the Ugandan family that are in America, but I'm sure you're going to keep in touch. I think you should show around the Ugandan family there, somewhere, like Mandar, yeah. the Ugandan family, Russia, the... If we're not a family, they wouldn't be here, yeah. I'll come alone, but we've been a family, and brother and sister, that's why they are here, until the last point, and go at one point to meet again the same of us in Uganda. She's going back home. She's a whole doc. She's a whole doctor. Look here. Say hi to my subscribers. Hi. I've also been living with NASA too, so I've enjoyed Russia. I would like to come back. You would like to come back, like to chill or no, to study to continue doing my masters. Yeah. To do a masters in medicine. Yes. Oh, uh, you'll be welcome. We'll be waiting for you. All right. Thank I'll be you. Glad to, to see you guys again. All right. Yeah.